हेलो फ्रेंड्स ग्रीटिंग्स फ्रॉम वाविकर इंस्टीट्यूट आई एम डॉक्टर चंद्रशेखर एम वाविकर मेडिकल डायरेक्टर ऑफ वाविकर इंस्टीट्यूट वी आर वेरी हैप्पी टू अनाउंस दैट वी हैव लॉन्च द लेटेस्ट टेक्नोलॉजी फॉर फ्रीडम फ्रॉम ग्लासेस कॉल्ड वेवलाइट प्लस सर कैन यू टेल एस वॉट इज दिस वेवलाइट प्लस टेक्नोलॉजी इज ऑल अबाउट first of all the technology was launched about few days back and we already done few successful surgeries so basically when we do lasik we are getting rid of glasses okay lasik is a name which is known to everybody but on everybody we cannot do lasik so there are different different technologies similarly in lasik also new technologies are coming like from lasik we went to contura and from contura now we are going to wavelight plus in contura we are taking measurement only of the front part of the eye that is the cornea whereas in case of wavelight plus we are taking three measurements number 1 is the front of the cornea what is done in uh, contura number 2 the aberrometry or the wavefront mapping or the ray tracing technology which is the latest addition in that rather than just introducing one ray to the center lots of rays are introduced in the eye and they are brought forward and they are studied what is happening at each and every point and third is length of the eye now because of this what happens that we are having very very personalized information about each and every eye so suppose there are two twins there are four eyes all four will have different different treatments now because we have got so many technologies and there are multiple permutation combinations and it is not possible for a human mind to come to treatment plan immediately that is where comes in the role of artificial intelligence so wavelight plus is a combination of three technologies number one lots of permutation combination and one of the technologies is ray tracing technology and third artificial intelligence and the computer makes a model of an eye and then decides the treatment and that's why it is truly personalized treatment possible sir in your hospital only you have three different technologies for freedom for glasses so how do you choose between them for a certain patient first of all no technology is good for 100% of the patient we have to study the patient's eye in detail and then decide what is to be done for example previously we never used to measure the strength of the cornea now that has become a very very important investigation similarly muscle Im- imbalance and corneal thickness and tomography and wavefront ray tracing i told you so multiple tests are done and accordingly we'll take a decision what is to be done so we have streamlight that is advanced surface ablation then we have normal lasik then contura then wavelight plus then smart sight and then icl so most of the patients will fit in either one of those even if we recommend one particular technology many times patient has an option to choose otherwise of course we'll tell the patient whether the choice is grossly wrong then of course we will not go ahead it with that technology but there are many instances when the patient has multiple options thank you